This summer, I'm working in Dr. Yana Kraft's laboratory. The overall project that we're doing in the lab is looking into if a probiotic-enriched yogurt could help prevent people that are pre-diabetic from developing type 2 diabetes. My specific project is kind of a smaller puzzle piece within that, so I'm looking at a hormone called adiponectin, which is produced by your body fat. Um, and it's involved in a lot of metabolic processes um, and regulating those. So it'll be kind of a puzzle piece to answer the question of how it impacts type 2 diabetes. When I was in high school, I lived in the Dominican Republic for a summer and ran a diabetes clinic there. I've gotten to travel a good amount and seeing how it affects different cultures and communities really differently. Food systems is really important, especially for this project, as the main um, vessel that we're using to deliver the probiotics is yogurt. That actually is like the perfect buffer um, for delivering things to your the microbiome of your gut. Especially with diabetes, food and nutrition is intensely involved and a really crucial component of treatment and prevention and all of that. The value of undergraduate research is um, massive at this age because for my career specifically, I will likely be doing research for years to come, decades to come. And there's not a lot of other situations in classrooms where you're learning like really how to correct mistakes and how to own up to them and how to work with a team and work with people that have different skill sets and different backgrounds and so I think there's just so much to learn from research at this age.